All right, y'all. Welcome to part two of a part two video. I guess that made sense, huh? <laughs> Look, go ahead and hit subscribe for me. And thank you for tuning in to the video. If you haven't seen part one, go back and watch part one. But I'm going to show you basically how to import multiple files at one time into Photoshop. So here we go. <laughs> All right, man. So I know you're probably wondering, Mo, if I had uh, 60 files, how could I bring them all into Photoshop at one time? You know what I'm saying? So I'm going to show you how to do that. So basically, you go up here to file, right? This is going to be a short video, y'all. So go ahead and unbuckle your seatbelt because you ain't going to be in this car long. So go to file. Go down to uh, scripts. And when you go to scripts, go down to load files into stack don't that make sense and then uh you can either load files or you can load a, a whole folder now the way i do it when i'm finna work on a project I, I already have every picture try to think of every possibility uh every possible thing that i want in a in my project into one file or one folder i'm sorry and I just go ahead and put it to one folder. So I would encourage you to do the same. So if you got all your files in one folder, that's cool. If not, you just click around on your computer until you can find all of them. And that's when you hit files, all right? So I got everything in one folder. So I'm gonna click that and hit browse. I'm already, uh, see this is what I wanna bring in on the pictures. You find, you find your folder or whatever, you hit your folder. It won't show you what's in your folder because you're gonna import the whole folder, right? All right, go down here to OK, click OK, and there we go. And if you don't want something over here or you want it sorted by name, you can click that. You can rearrange it uh, however you want to do it. So, oh my bad. Let me go ahead and do it again. All right, there we go. Back to where we need to be. All right, so I don't want um, I don't want the PS PSDs. I have in here because that's what I'm working on now so I'm gonna remove that you can remove it but I do want these three you feel me so you don't don't have to worry about uh, clicking one of these because this is gonna just put things in the center for you uh, create smart objects stuff like that if you don't want none of that, that's cool if you do click it simple press ok it's going to do its thing. You let it do its thing. You feel me? Hey, why it's doing this thing? I want to uh, shout out everybody who subscribed to the channel. I appreciate you. I appreciate you. Uh, Y'all ask for these videos in the comments. Let me know. Look at CNN telling lies. I'm just playing. I fuzz with CNN. But look, if y'all um, got any questions about something that you want to know, please, I need suggestions. So put them down in the comments for me. All right, I'm going to press Alt so I can zoom out and see everything. You see everything is right here. You feel me? You see all of the... Where's my uh, other one? There they go. Back there. See everything is right here. So basically it brought it over here. So that's all my files right here. So you can either click on the first layer up here, press Shift, hold Shift, and click on the last layer to select them all. If you don't want to do that... You can come over here and you can just click in the empty space, drag, and drag over everything, and you can move them like that together. So I'm going to choose to click one, shift, click the other one. I encourage y'all to uh, try to figure out y'all shortcuts because it's going to save you a ton. And just drag everything, pull it over to this tab, and boom, shaka laka, you in there. I'm going to press Control T while everything's selected, and Alt to size everything down no i don't have to press out i'm sorry i forgot i'm working in photoshop cc dog so i just pull it down you feel me and it'll be proportionate now if you ain't got photoshop cc and you still working in uh another photoshop uh then you will have to press out and ain't nothing wrong with that either so there go all my little files all in at one time you know what i'm saying so if we get these two things down and a few more little videos that's coming after this uh that i feel like that's important to move on with more complex stuff then we good we good and we rocking we're gonna do more fun stuff i'm gonna show y'all about ticks 
uh, how to put different colors and text gradients and all that good juicy stuff but we have to get through this first and i know there's some people that's on different levels of photoshop and um that's cool we're gonna work with you you see what i'm saying we're gonna work with you and uh they give me time to uh get to know you guys and know how and what you need to succeed at photoshop all right so y'all check out the descriptions the my description below i have my link to my website uh my facebook my instagram everything else so y'all stay tapped in y'all stay blessed corona is at large and it's on the loose so stay blessed stay blessed stay blessed and stay safe all right love all y'all peace out